Alright guys, today we're going to be doing the Heat Wave Fireball Draft. Uh, as you can see, my first three wins and two losses. Actually, those weren't my first. I've totally hit continue already. <laughs> but my uh, I haven't been recording yet, so I'm going to start doing it now. So let's hop into this. After going back and editing a lot of these videos, because I've really been enjoying making the Clash Royale of it. I'm just going to grab the Golem just so he doesn't have it. But, oh man, <laughs> such a high elixir deck right now. But I've noticed that I say so a lot as my filler word. I know a lot of people will say, like, um. And I try not to say that, but I've been saying so a lot as my filler word. I'm going to try to not do that as much. I have such a heavy, heavy deck right here. Let's just go ahead and expo to start us off. Lock on. Don't hit. There we go. And then we can magic archer this. Okay. Don't no fireball kills him, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. All right. This is this is gonna hurt a lot. So well played on him to get those wall breakers down. Thankfully, my rascals don't die to it. And then I think, yeah, we'll go ahead goblins that, just to see if enough pressure. Will, no, enough pressure will not even kill. Oh, perfect, perfect. Okay, good, 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 good. Now we're gonna let we're just gonna tank this. We're just gonna let him hit, and then we're gonna go him in the back. This is such a crazy deck. This is, oh man, dude. Okay, Ice Wizard, please do at least stop one of them. Perfect, thank you. All right, we're turning this into a beatdown expo deck. Never before seen on this channel. Go ahead and earthquake all of that. I wish my ice wizard was behind the golem. I'm not gonna expo now because I want my magic archer to kill the witch. Magic archer, kill the witch and then kill the goblins. Please stop missing. That a boy. That a boy. Tower down. Right? Close to it. If not, okay. We'll take that. We'll take that. All right. Go ahead, take care of that Dark Goblin. Ah, the Dark Goblin's so good. I just wanted the Magic Archer because of swarms. Like, he can just burst through them really easily. I'm going to Defensive Expo here. This d turns out to be a good idea. I like it. Okay, thank you, Expo, for locking onto the Witch. Now we're just going to Golem at the bridge. Oh, did that Golem what level... What did that golem say? It looked like it said 8 for a second. I don't know why. Because everything gets brought up. And actually, my goal. Yeah, it's level 9. Okay. My golem is level 9 anyway. I think it's actually level 10. Wait, did the uh, the death damage? Okay, I'll say, did he not hurt those minions? Right here. I mean, I really wanted him to. Oh, I need these wall breakers to die. Stat. Good. And then Ice Witch is going to take care of all that. I'm going to golem right here on this left side. Just to keep the pressure going. Actually, that was a bad idea. I should have been playing defense on this right. It's okay, though. Oh, fireball. Oh, the, I was at 541. All right, we got a good win. <laughs> Dude, we had such a high elixir deck there, and we got the win. All right. Ooh, hog rider, easy choice. Magic archer, easy choice. Rascals. Ooh, fireball. Especially since the elite, our barbarian barrel got nerfed. But, so the reason why I'm tr really trying... So, I have the Pass Royale, so... Obviously, whether I do it in this video or not, I'm gonna go through the whole thing and get all the wins. I really just want the rare tokens, though, because my Inferno Tower is super, super close. Well, not super close, but my Inferno Tower is on, on level 12 and needs to be level 13, and I'm not that close, actually. So, I need to get as many rare tokens as I can. I'll go ahead, Baby Dragon, here. Okay. After the baby dragon, we're going to hog rider, and then we'll have the fireball at the ready. Just like so. Is he going to play anything? He does. Just like that. Perfect, perfect. Um, what do I do here? Is this the play? I don't actually know how to defend against this ram rider without my inferno tower. I've been playing with the inferno tower for so long and so much. I just need you to kill the musky, thank you. Wow, dude, this hurts. Did I play that that poorly? Man. 
What did I... Wow, dude, I played that so poorly. I play that so, so poorly. Okay. That's the thing, like, I'm trying to learn. I'm trying to learn what's going on here in this game. So I've been playing this game since it came out, but I took, I like, I took like a whole year break. I've taken like plenty of breaks in this game. But I haven't been playing the whole time. As you can tell by that absolute miss of on the Ram Rider with the fireball. Now his musketeer is gonna be free to hurt me in many different ways. But I just like really enjoy that's the reason why I keep coming back to the game is because I really enjoyed it. And the reason why I stopped playing the game so many times is just dying to people who are pay to win. And now that this game is like a, like it's just five dollars for per season for that pass. It doesn't seem like a bad deal to me. So I went ahead and bought it and it's it is making the game more enjoyable, but I just need to keep I just need to keep it up. I need to keep playing. I need to learn more about individual cards. I don't want to get out of your way. I want you out of my way. Don't let her hit. Okay, she hits. Is this gonna if I Okay, that would kill. The fireball would kill. That tower if I need to. So let's see what happens. Do I need it to? I'm gonna go ahead and do it now. Oh man, I'm so dumb. Whatever. I wasted the fireball there, that's okay. That Ram Rider's gonna hit my King Tower. I'm alright with that. I'm gonna do Baby Dragon on this Goblin Gang for the splash damage. And then I'm going to Magic Archer back here, because he doesn't have any splash damage. He does have that Barbarian Bell, that's fine. And then my Hog Rider to push. Lots of pressure. The Goblin's back here. Because, alright, there you go, perfect. He wasted the Barbarian. And I'm gonna Prediction Fireball. Uh, came out way, way late. That would have been nasty. That would have been sick nasty. Alright, so we got a lead again. We're doing good. Let's see what he comes out with. Okay. I don't want to get out of your way. I want you out of mine. The Rascal Boy. I'm going to guards up top here so she'll hit him instead. That way. Oh, she did get a hit still. Man, that is crazy. Defensive Fireball. Oh, perfect. I don't know if it was worth it, but now, now that I see that Ram Rider got hit, it was totally worth it. Ice Spirit misses the Hog Rider. Hog Rider's pushing the Rascal up. I'm gonna Magic Archer right here. Oh, was he gonna go for the Crown Tower? No, he goes for it. Oh, dude, the Musketeer's not getting hit by that? Dang, I was hoping for the Snipe. I was hoping for the Snipe for the, <laughs> the Magic Archer to hit the Musketeer there. There we go, guys. Two wins in a row. I wasn't doing too hot before... As you can tell by my two losses, and I told you I've already had to hit continue. So, let's go ahead and get this last rare token, and then we'll end the video there. So, let's let's get it right now. Let's just go for it. Uh, I want the goblins. Here's the thing. I feel like I don't want the Lava Hound, because every time I've ever had them, I've lost. Minion Horde, there we go. Now, defend us against the, the Lava Hound, and I took the Fireball, so he doesn't have a counter to my Minion Horde. So, we should be in good standing. Ooh, a Skeleton Barrel? I like. Okay. Okay. I like I like what's going on here. Let's let him make the first move unless it hits 230 without him playing. Okay. I just got a notification on my phone. You guys can't see it, but it's there we go. It's saying my Clash Royale this stuff is ready. Um What can I do here? Ooh, Fisherman. And then Minion Horde. Oh, Fisherman's gonna hit the um, Barbarian though. Dang. One of the fishermen hit the giant. Can you still grab the giant? No, you're gonna grab her. Okay. Going for the lady. Whatever. And then we're gonna... Here we go. Skeleton Barrel. Ice Golem. Let's see what we can do here. Fisherman on the right side. Oh, here we go. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. Dude, the Skeleton Barrel is actually... Fairly good. I'm gonna fireball these guys. Okay, now I'm gonna save up for the minion horde here. Actually, I don't think I need to. I'm gonna be taking some damage, but I think my minions can take these guys, right? Yeah, yeah, he does. Okay. So now what I'm gonna do is set up the goblin hut. For a set up goblin hut. I'm gonna do one more back. Goblin Hut right here. 
Just to get some spam going. Okay. And then I'm gonna fisherman. Hopefully the giant. No, the oh, I played him too close. I wanted the fisherman the giant. Right there. I'm gonna fireball these guys. Did I hit the night witch? No, I didn't. I didn't hit the night witch and all that. So that didn't that wasn't too good of a play right there. On my end. I'm gonna get another goblin hut going. I guess, I mean, I did defend pretty well. Now nah, we're gonna Skeleton Barrel. You Lava Hunt, I'm gonna Skeleton Barrel. And Ice Skull. Just things are gonna target the tower, specifically. There we go, okay. That was good on him to do that. To do that barb. Oh, I really want Fireball right now. Please, I'm trying to recycle the Fireball right now. Please, please, please. Oh, this is gonna hurt. I don't fireball this. Thank you. Now, this is still about to start hurting. Okay, fisherman, grab that giant. Grab the giant. Please, 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 grab the giant. Okay. Oh, man. I need to. I need the ice golem. Here we go. Take these guys off one by one. One with that skeleton. We're gonna. What are we gonna do? Oh no, 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 no. Okay. Minion horde here. Skeleton barrel. Please don't die to E barb. Alright, I always say E barb. Barbarian barrel. We're gonna go ahead and fireball them now. Okay. Here we go. Okay. We got this, I think. I need that lava hound dead. Immediately. I needed that a long time ago. Skeleton barrel. Go in. Go in! Let's go! Oh, dude! Oh my goodness, how did I get so <laughs> lucky? Oh my goodness, I told you guys, I told you, I'm gonna get better, and it's for you. I'm getting better. There's my rare token. Let's go take a look to see how many tokens I have. So I have three rares and three epics and one common. No legendary, so here's the thing. I don't need epics anymore, thankfully. I have my poison, I just don't have the gold for it. My Val Valkyrie is max. So I need seven or 678 more Inferno Towers for that to be max. So if I have three rares, that'll give me 150. That's a pretty big jump. And then obviously I have the common tokens for the skeletons. The skeletons are, they're my very last priority. I mean, they're just skeletons. They're mostly there to like stop like Prince charges and stuff like that in cycle. So what I really need, I'm at, I got another miner. I, th I don't think I showed that since my last video. I don't remember. Um, but this is what we're working with here. This is the main ladder deck. This is something I didn't learn a long time ago. If you're just not starting to play Clash Royale, here's something you need to know. You need to find your deck as early as you can. Obviously, you're not going to find it. Like, if you're just starting your in Arena 1, you're not going to find your deck for a long time. You need, you need to unlock all the cards before you can find your deck. But once you find your deck, you just need to keep that deck and only upgrade the cards in that deck. Because what I didn't know... Is it, can I, yeah, by level. I've leveled up so many cards. I've leveled these two to level 13. I've leveled up so many cards to 12 and 11. And I don't even ever use them. Like I never use them, ever. I use these three, uh, Knight, Archers, and Zap, and Bats for the longest time, and Princess for like the longest time. That's why those guys are highest level. But I've leveled up so many cards I didn't need to, and I wish I would have known that early on. But nonetheless, we're here now. We're going to keep doing this fireball draft. I'm going to end the video here, but I'm going to keep doing the fireball draft on my own. And then we're going to start doing more challenges. I'm going to do ladder matches too on here because i got to get some ladder matches going, right? But I want to get better at classic challenges just so I can get better with other cards. Because if I can get better with other cards, I can get better at defending against them. So... Want you guys to know this, that ROE is still there, running on empty. It's going to stay there forever. Look in the look in the description below. Go look at the Twitter, okay? We're just starting off. We're learning what's going on. We're trying to get things going, so help us get things going, all right? Thank you, guys.